Yeah. Yeah. Are you good? Yeah, I'm good. All right, so what was it like, you know, this whole experience getting to... Uh, it was a great experience, you know, get to go out with the squad and, you know, play the first couple of games before the season even start. You know, it was a good team, team bonding. Uh, you know, it was just a good experience on the court and off the court. Got to see different things that we learned about in school, like uh, the Vatican, Sistine Chapel, just everything. It was a great experience all around. Was there one or two of the, you know, sites that, you know, really stuck out to you? Uh, Sistine Chapel and Lake Como. Those, those were the most exciting sites. Well, what's it like? I mean, most people have only seen in it's pictures in the internet. What's it yeah, like actually looking up and seeing it's it? It's mind blowing, you know, being it, like being taught in history class about it and then just seeing it in person is just mind blowing, you know. It was just a good experience and I, I think everybody loved it. How do you think this helped you guys, not just on the court, build that chemistry, but, you know, create the these court. bonds, camaraderie, yeah. all that? Uh, you know, we got a lot of new guys, so, you know, this helped us, you know, just being together like all 10 days, you know, the long 10 days, then we were out of the country. So there's a whole bunch of team bonding, just created a whole bunch of chemistry. So it helped us a lot. Did it help you adjust? I mean, you, you, you said out last year, but you practiced with the team last yes. year. How, how you come along adjust? Yes, uh, it, helped, it helped me adjust, you know, I ain't played a game in about a year, so more than a year. So it helped me, you know, getting uh, in game flow and it just helped me running the plays, just, you know, being coached by Coach Samson in a real actual game, you know, just helped me Helped me a lot. Describe the competition, the level of competition. Where was it compare? How did uh, you compare? The level of competition was good. You know, we played some decent pro teams over there, Italian pro teams, uh, big physical. So that's like that's what we play. You know, they were very physical. So you know, how we we play uh, very physical as we try to focus on rebounding. So that helped us a lot with the rebounding. I believe I felt like we got better um, rebounding from game one to game four. So it helped us a lot. I feel like uh, this is going to be a big part of our success uh, during the year. Was it tough adjusting to uh, FIBA rules? Uh, a little bit. Yeah, a little bit. But we were practicing, so we used those FIBA rules during the 10 practices that we had. So it wasn't as bad, but it was a little bit tough, you know, get actual game flow and playing against different people. How different is the ball? I heard, like, Chris Middleton was saying, like, the first time he shot, he's like, yeah, the, ball, the grooves, it yeah, just feels yeah, different. Yeah, the, ball, the balls are very different. When, you, when it gets wet, very slippery. So, you know, we got used to that in the 10 practices. But over there, you know, the gyms were very hot. Some of the gyms didn't have any AC, so you know the balls were as wet as I don't know. They were wet, so you know we got used to them though. But uh, by game by game four, it was it was normal. So. Did y'all go anywhere and were recognized? Excuse me. Did y'all go anywhere where y'all were recognized by anybody? Like from America, say so you race? Yeah, I, I yeah, know yeah. Every, everywhere we went, everybody. Oh, can we take pictures? You know, we got a Houston basketball gear on. Can we take pictures? Can we do this and that? So you know, we were kind of like the celebrities over there. So you know, it was it was it was. It was a good experience. I loved it. Thank you, man. Awesome, right. man. Appreciate, Appreciate you. you.